Welcome back guys. So we are going to be talking about seeds today and my seed collection and what I have in here. And if you guys want to uh, trade seeds, let me know in the comments below and we shall trade seeds. All right. So let's talk about this first package here I just got today. And this came from Jimmy and Diane Jones. Auto parts. What is it? Auto parts to flower seeds. All right. And they are in the Texas area. So the package comes like this. Bubble wrap, and inside it says thank you. Then you get 10 of these cucumber seeds. And these are the basket seeds, hanging baskets. So you know the cucumbers won't grow as big. So I'm excited for that because you know, I have an indoor greenhouse. So I like to grow vegetables that I can actually want to grow inside doors and don't get too, too big. So yes, that's what I'm all about. All right, so yeah, get these. So you get 10 of those. And it just says a hanging basket cucumber, so one third deep. All right, needs sun five hours a day, and then it's 50 days to fruit. All right. Now and it says a little note here, and it says thank you so very much for your uh, purchase from Jimmy and I. You are appreciated, and you do make a difference. All purchases help to refill, uh, refill, refill. Fill, I'm sorry, refill Jimmy's. 12 week oxygen tanks and other purchases of Jimmy's. Uh, Cathra, Cathra urine tubes from his prostate surgery. And you help, your help did make a difference. So my help did make a difference. I don't know why I couldn't read that real quick. But yeah, that's what that is from. So we will be giving these a try. We will be planting these soon. And I have some sweet corn. This is Sun Days Hybrid. This is by Burpees. And I paid $4.99 for these. I got these out of Lowe's. Okay. And it just says three times more seeds in here. Uh, 78 day harvest. So you get that. And that's that yellow corn. All right. This is the peppers. You can get these from the Dollar Tree. And this is the California Wonder American seed. All right. So you can get these from the Dollar Tree for a dollar. And these are just the green peppers. Okay. It's a lot in here, guys. <laughs> All right. And then you got some tomato seeds. And these are the large cherry tomatoes. So it looks like that here. And these are from the Dollar Tree also. No, these aren't from the Dollar Tree. They might be from Dollar Tree. But yeah, that's what I have right here. As you guys can see, I love tomatoes. So I have a lot of tomatoes. You see my tomato alley here. So, yeah. All right. And then these are the green beans. And this is their tender green improved. And that's what they look like here. If you guys can see that. Hopefully I'm holding it up right for you guys. So that's the green beans, just in case I wasn't holding it up right. There's the tomatoes. These are the large cherry tomatoes. And these are the green bell peppers. In this case, I wasn't holding these up right, okay, guys, because I can't see. And then I have the sweet corn from Burpees. Okay. Now, if you find those jars with the fruit, I mean, with the vegetables you can grow, do not get those. Don't get them. Stay away from them. Clear away from them, okay? Use the seeds, but listen, just stay away from them. Go and buy some seeds and you should be fine, all right? Don't use those jars. It seems like nothing never works in there, all right? So I still have some um, mint seeds here that I kept. I never put them all in there, so... I got some mint seeds, although I am growing some spearmint and some sweet mint. And then I got some tomato seeds here also, all right? I tried that in those jars. They do not work out. They come up and then that's it, all right? So I'm going to try them a different way, all right? So I just got rid of the jars, all right? So and this was from the brand Back to the Roots, all right? Um, and get this from Bowles. So just stay away from that brand. Stay, stay, stay away from it. Well, not the brand itself, but just stay away from it. All right? It's no good. No good. 
All right, and then I have some watermelon. These are the Bush Sugar Babies. I heard these are really, really good, guys, and I want to try some of it. So I cannot wait. I heard they're really sweet. So I definitely want to try that, and um, yeah, give it a try. I want to go some watermelon. Watermelon, watermelon. <laughs> All right, then I got some carrots. These are the short and sweet. So I'll definitely be able to grow these in the house without them worry about them getting too big. And everything I grow is going to be in container form. So you, you already know. So if you want to grow indoors in containers in a greenhouse, hit your girl up. Watch your girl because your girl is going to give you some good information. Whether it's good or bad, we're going to go through it together. So yeah, carrots. And these are the short and sweets. Okay. Next thing, I have some spinach. Mmm, spinach. I'm pretty sure the spinach grows up good, but for me, it didn't grow up well. So, I'm going to try it again, and we're going to see. Like I said, you have to practice. Don't just give up, all right? Don't give up. Practice. Now, I have some uh, Spanish variety peppers here. I'm going to try these again. They didn't do too well for me. So we're gonna try them again, all right? We're gonna try them again, yeah. The corn, I was gonna plant this corn. Uh, and this is the hair long corn. I was gonna plant, I mean, I'm sorry, the carrots. I was gonna plant this, but I didn't plant it. I did open it, I, did, oh, I didn't plant it because I found the other corn, um, carrot that I wanted to plant, so yeah. So if anybody want this, let me know, and I'll give them some seeds, all right? I'm not sure how many seeds is in there, but I'll give them some seeds. It's open, so you'll know it's open, but I'll not take any out, all right? So if you want the carrots, Danvers, hair, or hair long, American seed carrot, let me know in the comments below, and I shall send it out to you, all right? This is parsley, and it says great... Um, Containing the gardening, so which is awesome. Parsley, all right. Next thing, I got some corn. This is the early golden bam. What's that? Bam tama corn. I'm pretty sure this corn grows kind of big, like a regular size corn. So I did not grow this corn. Okay, I am looking for. Listen, if anybody can. Send me some small ear corns, like the ones that grow small, but not like that, but like, you know, that you, that you could actually grow indoors. Please send me those, and I will send you some of these, okay? I'll send you some of these, and I'll also send you some of these, all right? Please, please, please. You girls begging. Yeah, I'm really begging. <laughs> so, if you can find those little corn, uh, uh, carrots, I mean the corn, the corn, the small ones that you can grow in containers indoors, please send me those, and I will send you some of these each. Some of these each, and some of these. All right? All right. Next thing I got is some Kentucky Wonder bowl type, pole type uh, bean, okay? So this is one I'm growing now. I think I have two packs of these. And that's the ones that just grow tall, like, like on the vine, okay? This is not a bush bean. This is the one that grows like a vine, all right? So that's what that is. Next thing I have is some Alaskan peas. I'm not open these up either. Anything you see in here and you want to trade off on, hit me up in the comments and we can, we'll see what we can do, okay? Some more Alaskan peas. These are the Heirlooms Blue Lake 274 Garden Beans, okay? This is squash. This is the early yellow straight neck squash. Um, I've purchased this one and I also purchased the uh, crook neck one. And I'm thinking I should be able to grow the crook neck one better in home because it's smaller, I think. Not sure. But yeah, this is what I have. This is the tender, well, we've seen these beans. The tender green improved bean. We've seen those. Okay. I did tell you I had some babbles. <laughs> this is the heirloom varieties, the dwarf blue curled vex. This is the kale. So, I, like I said, I'm going to let these ones die off so I can plant some of these in that container there. 
And this is the one you can grow indoors is the dwarf kind. You can grow this outside and get a little larger outside, but not so big, okay? Like the ones you'll actually see growing like literally like stalks, all right? These are kind of smaller, okay? So yeah, dwarf, kale. This is some Swiss chard, and this is the mixed color variety, heirloom variety there. I haven't tasted this before. I don't know what it tastes like. I like to know what it tastes like. Maybe. It's very pretty, too. So, I do like a variety of color on my plate. So, yeah. Pretty, 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 pretty. pretty. This is cabbage. Early Golden Acre cabbage. All my packets have seeds in them. All my packets have seeds in them, all right? So, don't forget, guys, if you see something you're liking, you want to trade off one, if you get in them comments. Also, if you are not subscribed to me and you made it this far in the end of that video, hmm, why haven't you subscribed? Subscribe to your girl. By the way, after you hit that subscribe button, hit the bell next to it. Notifies you when I've uploaded a video. All right, this is chives. Love me some chives on some potatoes. Oh, so delicious. So delicious. Delicious. All right, cilantro. I haven't even grown this yet. And this is Coradana. Danara. Something like that. I don't know. What that <laughs> we got some broccoli. Calabrisa. Broccoli. Yeah, I got broccoli right here growing. Then we got some lettuce. This is Paris Island, COS heirloom. So I'm going to try to grow some lettuce. As you guys know, your girl keeps it real with you. You already seen that my lettuce didn't grow that I was trying to grow that was already grown from the store. So I'm going to try my own. All right, chutney, carrots. I purchased these because I thought these would be a small variety too. I did open them up to see what it looks like inside. Um, so I'm going to try these also because they do look like a small, small variety also. So I want to try some of those. Then we have some more Alaskan peas. <laughs> Did I want these? You ain't got to switch. This, you really don't have to trade it. I have two packs. This makes the third pack. So I don't need any more Alaskan peas. I'm only in a home that's going to be feeding three people. So there you go. Give me in the comments if you want these Alaskan peas. Broccoli, once again. Then we got some peppers. These are the California Wonder Peppers. Another dwarf blue curled vets kale. Um, and these are the beef steak tomatoes. Alright. Alright guys, and then we have some corn. This is the early golden bantam. Um, cool one. So, anybody want a pack out of these? Let me know. We don't have to do a trade off, all right? So, there you go. I have enough corn. I would still love to get the small ears of corn. And I forget the name of those. These are some strawberry seeds that I. <laughs> yes, I took the time off of the strawberry time out my time <laughs> to pick these little tuna things. And they are changing. See how small they are? Look how small these things are. They are small, yes. But you yourself can pick these, okay? That's what I did. I just picked them off. I scraped the skin off of the uh, strawberry. I let the skin dry on a napkin. It still works on a napkin. Just got to be gentle, and you can start plucking it off once the skin dries. But, yes, I got me some strawberry seeds. <laughs> yeah, I know you got nuts. I am. <laughs> nuts for food, okay? This is the sweet basil, and this is the herb, of course. And I don't think I have it. Yeah, I don't have any more of that. I was saving this to see what I can use. Don't worry about it. All right, and this is the squash, early neck. 
curly neck, <laughs> yellow straight neck, <laughs> squash. Whew. Next thing we have is the Grand Bell Mixed Peppers. So these look beautiful. So I'm going to be trying to grow some of these. I have a few peppers in here already. I'm going to try to save some of my seeds from my candy cane peppers. I heard they're really good and nice and sweet. I'm definitely going to try and save some seeds from those. This is another pepper. This is the bell pepper. All right, this is a pea and bean booster. Grow more beans and peas. This is what you put in there in your uh, soil to help your beans and a lot of things and things like that grow, the peas, so you put that in there. So that's what that is. I just keep this in so I remember where this is. Lima beans, we are growing lima beans right now and as you speak. And these are from Burpees. Fork hood, two for two. Okay. And guys, guess what? I have a surprise for you guys in about another month. No, not even. A few weeks. I have a surprise. All right. And these are some cucumbers. These are the pickle bush pick, uh, cucumbers. Because I love me some pickles. I really do, especially in the summertime. So I cannot wait. I will be starting these now. It takes 52 days. Hmm. I'd be getting them almost around all this, but that's all right. I love pickles. So, I cannot wait. And these are from Burpees. And these are the pickle bush cucumbers, right? Spinach. And these are from Burpees. Tunes the salad sensation hybrid. Spinach. Papa, the sailor man. All right. More peas. Who would have thunk? And these are peas. These are little Marvel peas. From Heirloom. Cantaloupe. We are growing now as we speak. And this is a Hell's Best Jumbo. In this container. Now, I will be moving... Just like these out of here, and I'll keep one in here, and I'll have to get some more bags. Well, I have more bags, and I want to grow some cucumbers. So I have three cucumber growing up now. They're looking beautiful. So I need to get five more bags. I have a seven-gallon bags, so I will be just filling those up, and each of these will grow a big cucumber. I mean, a big, a big cantaloupe, and I cannot wait, guys, for you to see this. I can't wait to see this either, so I can't wait. And that's cantaloupe. Now, this is the early summer crook neck. <laughs> crook neck. Heirloom squash, guys. Crook neck. Crook a letter, crook a letter, crook a letter. Right. Mississippi, all right? Remember that song? Who does not remember that song, all right? But yes, crook neck. Squash. These are the sh uh, super sugar peas, all right? I got those. These from Burpees. Um, all right guys we have two more to go and we are finished. <laughs> and these are the onions these are the white lesbian lisbon bunching onions so love these onions here they go here aren't they beautiful gorgeous and they smell so delicious and they taste really good, guys. They really do. They taste really, really good. So those are what those are. Last one. And this is, of course, a tender green improved thing. All right, guys. So that's all you girl got. So if you want to do some switching around or even, like I said, those, um, the, the corn here, if you guys can find me the corn. Also, I'm going to be giving away a packet of peas. Whoever wants it, the first person that says they want the peas, they will get them. Um, now, whoever can find me 
Oh, and the small corn to the other corn. A pack of the corn. Now, now, those are two I'll be giving away. Now, whoever can find me the corn that grows small, not those little things. I mean, like about that size right there that can grow in containers that is not going to get large. Those are the ones I'm looking for. I, I forget the name of those, but I know there's someone out there. So if you want to switch, if you have those, um, I will switch you with two different kinds of corns. Um, the sweet corn from Sunny Days Hybrid. I will give you some seeds out of here. And also, I will give you some seeds out of the other corn package that I have. I don't know where it went to, but it's down here. You've seen it in the video already. So, yeah, that's what I want to do, guys. So, if you can let your girl know about that, we will definitely be winning together. That's the corn. There we go. And this is the corn. Early golden now. So, if anyone can find me that corn, that's small, that grows small. Forget the name of it. It's like a dwarf-sized corn. You can get some seeds out of this one and also this one. Okay? Please. Also, I'm giving away peas and corn, a packet of corn. So you got to uh, let me know in the comments. Was it peas and corn? Yeah, peas and corn. So you got to let me know. And as you guys can see, the person that's going to be sending me the corn, if they do have, you see, I have two packs. So, and they're both close, so you know they won't be open, okay? And neither is the burpees, all right? So I'm going to be doing corn. And peas, I'll give away the first ones that say they want either or, not both packets, but either or, you can have a zombie you ready. <laughs> now, for the person that says they could find me that corn and send me some seeds, I'll be sending you some seeds out of this one and out of this one. It's for seeds, but out of one of your packs. And I appreciate you guys. So, this has been a long haul, a long collection. I hope you guys liked this video. If you do, please give me a big thumb up. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button next to it. Hit that bell notification. Notifies you when you guys upload a video. And please, let's grow together so we can eat together.